so our first question is in a bag there are 20 kg of fruit isn't it this one is the question na? yes question number 1 yeah so there are 20 kg of fruit and 7 one and a half kg of these fruits are oranges 8 to by 3 kg of are uh, apples and rest are grapes this line is important rest okay. are grapes find the mass of grapes in the bag a very simple question total weight 20 kg weight of oranges 71 by 6 kg weight of apple good the total weight of apple and oranges good statement okay yeah so you have take converted mixed fraction to improper fraction 40 to 43 this is correct what is this 82 by 3 chobis put it chobis 6 26 by 3 okay you have taken lcm so lcm of 6 and 3 is 6 So multiplying it by two, you got fifty-two. Ninety-five by six. Again, converting into mixed fraction. Ninety-five. Divided by six. Okay, this here is the calculation. Three five six five is a thirty. Yeah, perfect. Fifteen five by six. Total weight of fruit minus total weight of apple and oranges equals to weight of grapes. Good. I'm glad that you are writing formula. So subtracting these two, where is working for this? So there, is, there are two whole numbers. So twenty minus fifteen. No, this is incorrect. This part is incorrect. Okay. So instead of converting into this, you can solve it from here. So twenty minus ninety-five by six. Okay. Uh, yes. Do it right now, and tell me okay. the answer. So, what will be the next step? So then, twenty uh, upon one. Yeah, I can take it here. And yeah, twenty upon one, and then twenty into six, and one into six. Yeah, which is one twenty upon six. Six minus ninety-five minus. upon six. That so becomes forty-five upon six. Yeah. Thirty-five. Uh, yes. Yes. I guess it will be twenty-five, no? See, adding no, first to this. Yeah. See, I can do it this way also, or I can just look at like ninety-five plus five is five hundred plus twenty, so twenty-five. Okay, look here. Ten. Okay. One. Five. Yes. Eleven. Two. Twenty-five. Okay. Okay. Twenty-five by six. So, yes. what kind of fraction is this? Improper. That becomes a four one upon six. Four one upon six. Kg. Okay, so let me just uh, clarify your doubt. I know after looking, watching the videos which I have shared and discussing directly, what you have done. So twenty minus fifteen, and this is five by six. If you want to do it directly, I know you are trying to do directly. So try to understand yeah. it this way: minus fifteen. Minus five point six. So there are two numbers. So twenty minus fifteen is five. Minus five point six. 
5 minus 5 upon 6 means i cannot do it directly so i am rewriting this way 4 plus 1 minus 5 upon 6 and 1 can be written as 6 upon 6 Five point six four. It will be plus one upon six. Answer would be four one upon six. Is it making sense? Uh, so I didn't understand how it became why you wrote it as four plus one. Yeah. So from a whole number, I can subtract a part of it, isn't it? Okay. So yes. five minus five upon six. See. all this thing i am writing right now but in long term you will have to do it in mind so i am just showing you mental calculation so out of five things there are five things i have to take up take away five upon six things take up that means i need to divide the thing into six equal parts let's say 1 2 3 4 5 6 so okay. if i take away five parts So I have one, two, three, four, and one part is left, isn't it? Yes. Now, it, now is it clear? Yes. So, so, most important step is this one. Why I did subtraction? <laughs> I'll explain it once more. See, fifteen or fifteen. Uh, uh, This was fifteen, na? No? Yeah, fifteen five point six means you know that. Can you tell me? Ah, uh, fifteen five point six means ah uh, ninety five point six. No, that is conversion. But what does it oh. mean? It means fifteen. Fifteen plus five point six. Very good. So if I just put a negative sign outside, that means I'm multiplying the whole number by negative. Ah uh, yes. So it means minus fifteen, minus five point six. Is it clear why I wrote that thing as minus? Yes. 